Hey there, this is Bug Powder Dust. Thank you for joining me for episode 6 of Let's Play Prison Architects, and this is series 3, Alpha 31. So, at the end of yesterday's episode, we saw the, f uh, the finishing, correctly finishing, of the yard area. We had uh, a yard, one single yard like this, but it turns out it wasn't wide enough. <laughs> and I had to break it into three, so there's a bit of a gap here. You can see it says yard three times, but I don't think it's going to cause any problems in terms of games. Um, I'm going to prettify the jail, put grass and trees and stuff in, but I need to prioritise what I'm doing here. So what I need to do, I've spotted a couple of things that I need to fix. Firstly, I need to put in a wall here, because that just looks silly. And I'm going to put an airlock uh, here, because um, I think an airlock's a good idea. Make sure they don't get any ideas about wandering out, and then set this to staff only. Because I've had that before and it's just annoying. Uh, okay, so that's that queued up, and let's get a jail door in there as well. And then we'll set that to staff only, as I said now. It's eating time, so let's just keep an eye on this. One, um, one of the people commented on my channel saying that Max and Min fight, or are more likely to fight. Is this true in your experience? I honestly didn't think that any one class prisoner was more or less prone to fight with any other type of prisoner. I mean, obviously you wouldn't mix minimum and maximum set prisoners in real life, but, you know, this isn't real life. So, any thoughts on that would be appreciated. Because I don't think that happens, but I don't normally bother with minimum set prisoners, but I thought I'd put them in just for... just for a bit of colour, really. Uh, so, bladder and bowels are down, that's good. They all need to sleep, but that's okay. It's all looking alright. The toilet's back up again, that's the main thing. So, if they do need to do bowel stuff, they can. Um, right, so let's get on with this area. Minsec. Because it does appear we have more Minsec available than medium or max. So, let's fill up. In fact, we've got, we're going to fill up Minsec tomorrow. Mm. I didn't really think Jail would fill up this quickly, to be honest. And I was expecting there to be more Maxsec available, but there really isn't. There's hardly any. Nevertheless, it's not a problem. What I would need, do need to do is get a member of staff to patrolling down here. Did I set this? No, I didn't set that up yesterday because I didn't have any Min, but I do now. So let's just get that set up. Right, so I've got three guards patrolling with three blocks, I've got a guard in the middle and a couple of guards outside, and we've got four available. That's fine. Okay. Right, so my workmen have done a blinder and done this really nicely, so let's set that to... Now the only trouble is if I make this an airlock and set it to staff only. It means that these guys don't get fresh clothes delivered by the workmen. That would have to be an overnight thing, I guess, by the janitors, who I think deal with that. But that's not a big deal. Uh, let me just do that for a moment. Staff only. There we go. So that's the airlock done. What we now need to do is clone this. Just sprinkle that along. And then we need to set up uh, where are we? Beds. Uh, I would clone this, but obviously I don't have one already installed, so I might as well just do it. A fresh one here. Now these cells are a bit sparse, so what I'd like to do is get a phone booth in. Because I mean, they're protective. So I want to try and make them as happy as possible. Stick a TV in here as well, I suppose. It's facing the right way, isn't it? Uh, yeah, there we go. You guys can't open the door, can you? Right, so that's going in. Everyone's eating. Yep. Those that are hungry, anyway. Uh, yard. Right, so I'm going to mark that as the yard. Have I fallen afoul of that 5x5 five five thing again? No, this is fine this time, isn't it? So 
Perhaps that's the yard for those boys. Uh, canteen and kitchen. Uh, rooms. So let's get that set up. Canteen. And kitchen. Now I'm not going to zone that as a kitchen just yet. In fact I'm not going to zone that as the canteen just yet either. Otherwise I think you get cooks coming in here and don't really need that at this point in time. Just for now. Is that a normal door? Staff door. Do you think a staff door is going to keep legendary prisoners from smashing through it? But if I make that a jail door, only officers, prison officers can unlock it, which means that when my cooks try to bring out food to the canteen, they won't be able to do it themselves. Hmm. Fortunately, I can put that problem off until I actually get a legendary prisoner, I guess. Now, one thing I forgot to do here is showers. But what I'm going to do, I'll just put that on the outside, and then they can just shower on the outside of their cells. So, let's do that here. So we got... That one can be his. Just put them on opposite ends for different people. So you come out and turn right and that's your shower. So that's yours, that's yours, that's yours, that's yours, that's yours, and... That's a bit rubbish being there, isn't it? But that's okay. Sticking drains everywhere will be fine. We haven't put doors on the cells either, so I need to do that. I couldn't clone the door because it was uh, part of the wall which is already there. I don't think you can do that anyway, but... In fact, let's set this to unlocked for now, because it really doesn't matter at this point in time. That way, there's no micromanaging the doors for the, uh, the workmen. Okay. There we go, that's that. What I do need to put in is a CCTV at the bottom here. In fact, if I just move it along a little bit, still get the same benefit, but also get some of this side as well. Um, okay, so that's a CCTV in. So that's the protective area more or less done. What I would like to do is get the canteen up, so let's sort that out, let's get rid of that, get rid of that. Now the canteens just need benches and serving tables, don't they? So let's get that table. Now there's never going to be more than two, four, six, eight, yeah, okay. Well I'll deal with that when I come to it, but for now let's just have one bench, uh, one table, sorry, with a couple of benches. That'll be enough. We need a serving table. Just put that just outside the door. And that's pretty much that for the canteen. That's, that's very easy to do. Dezone, obviously, for now. We'll just zone it when we get to have um, some legend, uh, sorry, protective prisoners. Now, for the kitchen, it gets a bit more complicated. So we need um, a cooker. We need a fridge. And we need a sink cooker, fridge, and sink. I know the kitchen doesn't need to be quite as big as it is, but you know, it is what it is. So we need a bin as well, a trash can, should I say? Maybe a couple. Okay, I think that's pretty much it for the kitchen. But we do need to plumb it in, of course. So let's just get that. It's going to be the sink. Needs plumbing. These two just need electricity. So let's run that across there. And probably need to just be touching it there. Okay. Right. So that's good to go as and when. I'm going to. I don't want that yard to be accessible by the other prisoners. And one of them's going to come in here and try and do that, I think. Mean. Also, this area too unlocked. Do that. Yeah, okay. Yeah, fair enough. So. Okay, that's some good progress there. Glad about that. Now, let's make sure everyone's needs are met. Am I missing anything of this? Well, hygiene's going to build up. 
getting to sleep. That's all fine. Next one's for recreation. I think some of this is down to the fact they only had a, a rubbishy yard yesterday, so that's good. Uh, time for clothing. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Right, good. We're doing alright. One thing I do need to do is... There's something I need to do. Metal detectors, that's right. I need to put the metal detectors back in these doorways. I knew that there was something that had to be done. Metal detector, so one there, one there. I never have too many metal detectors, quite frankly. What's that doing there? That's for the staff. Okay. So I wonder if things looking quite nice and kind of ready to go. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to put... Hang on a minute. What does this mean? Concrete tiles. Okay. Oh, those are gardening. That's concrete tiles. These are garden. I thought these squares were existing concrete tiles to be laid, so I didn't want to uh, duplicate the work there. So that's fine. That's gardening as well. So that's also fine. There's a concrete tile around here. Just eager to make the um, the movement of prisoners kind of as fast as possible. Because the slower they are to get to, say, their food, the more their needs build up. I can kind of do without that, to be honest. So that's looking fine. Now, is there anywhere that doesn't have paving that they're going to need to get to and from? No, that's all indoors. It's all looking fine. Good. So, 4.50 in the morning. I should have done a cell block search, shouldn't I? Maybe I've still got time. Who haven't we done? Minimum. So let's do them quickly. Don't have a huge amount of time to do these guys, but it'll be enough, I think. Maxec. I mean, there's really only two of them. Well, there was, anyway. Now, what I'm going to do very quickly is just to get this grant. I'm going to build a quick holding cell. I mean, I don't need it. But I'm just going to build it just to clear this grant out. Now, uh, I'm going to put it here because it's kind of a useful little kind of overflow area. Um, now, for the holding cell, five by five. Okay. Ooh. Good point. I've got to do foundations, haven't I? We'll just plan this out very quickly. Planning. There we go. Walls. So it needs to be six by six for, for to get a five by five room. Is that right? No, 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 no. Seven by seven. That's right, because it's two on either side. So that's cool. Yep. Right. So building brick. Let's just. It's got five squares. And stick a door in. Let the workman get on with that, and then I'll just clear it. Can you remove foundations? Yeah, you can. Excellent. Okay, great. So everyone's still sleeping. Shower, free time, eat. So you should empty their bowels here and eat. Yeah, that's fine. A couple of toilets there for those who have to go twice. Need to finish off, maybe. Okay, so our guards are finished here and they'll be... Well, they will be finished in time for... All oh, found small contraband. They're finished in time for the, the uh, prisoners to arrive, so that's good. Is that CCTV in? It is. So let's hook that up to our monitor. Just there. Cool. All right, guys can come through. And we need to hook up power. There we go. For the moved metal sexes. Okay. Wow, that was quick. Didn't muck about, did they? Okay, holding cell. Oops, holding cell. Five by five. It needs to be enclosed, which it is. We need indoors, toilet, and a bench. It's easy. Indoors, toilet, toilet, bench. Toilet, bench. There we go. I'm guessing the toilet has to be connected up to the. Uh, so what I'll do, just to save a bit of time, I'll put the toilet over to 
there. And that saves me having to actually build a pipe. And then I'll just bulldoze it. Right. New prisoners arriving in an hour. Now, is this deployable? Yes, it is. Excellent. So let's have a guard out here. There we go. So he can be the one doing gates and stuff. Instead of me. Well, completion payment. There we go. Awesome. Right, dismantle. 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 And bulldoze. Cool. Now, temperature's rising. Oh, decrease. Oh, it's showers. Okay. Just have your shower, people. Just relax. It's all good. Wow. Look at you. You need everything. Dude. You're a regular pain in the neck, aren't you? Oh. Yeah, drains. Drains are your friend. Don't think I've missed any other ones, have I? Okay. Right. It's gone. Temporary holding cell has gone. So while we're on the subject of grants, let's have a look and see which ones we can unlock. Two offices, hire a warden, unlock finance, hire a council. I think I've got that. Thank you. Cell block A. Take that. Thank you very much. Medical ward 2, doctor psychologist. Thank you very much. Prison maintenance. Unlock cleaning grounds. Yeah, I'll take that. Unlock groundskeeping. Okay. Can I unlock two? Yeah, visitation rights. Visitation three, common room, blah, blah, blah. Take that as well. Lovely. This is easy, isn't it? Need to unlock groundskeeping. Okay, let's do that very quickly because everything else has been unlocked. Uh, where are we? Groundskeeping. We've got dogs now. Excellent. So where's our kennel? Our kennel was there. Where it says KE. Funnily enough. So let's crack on. Get some dogs in. Always good having dogs roaming about. I like them. Uh, Ken. Ken, Ken, Kennel. Uh, we need. Um, so it's enclosed. Minimum size 5 by 5. We need two dogs. Well, let's go with two to start off with. Uh, we've got enough income. And get a couple of dog crates, which are there. Doesn't need a sofa, does it? So, no. Stuff. Hey, you got some dogs. Yeah, that's cool. Right, so let's get some um, dog. I was about to say dog doings, but that's that's really not the right word. We're going to get um, dog handler to. That seems absolutely the wrong tab as well. So we want deployment. I oh, want dog patrols. We get a dog to walk up and down here. That's a really boring patrol. Very highly trained, just to wander about in storage. Um, actually, what I might do is go out to the corridor as well. We get one dog to go there, and we're going to get the other dog to. Um, it's probably best if they wander around the canteen because that's where everyone is kind of congregated at least three times a day. So it makes sense for them to wander around in the canteen and there's going to be a kickoff. It's going to be there. So let's Good enough. Right. There we go. Okay. What's he doing? I don't know what he's doing. Glitchy muck glitcherson. That doesn't look particularly patrolly to me. Oh, that's interesting. There we go. Try that. Does that work? Does that work for you? There we go. That's my fault, by the looks of it. Or is it? You're going to move? Yes, there we go. I hadn't taken for some reason. Okay, excellent. Oh, yeah, more people arrived. Damn. Right, okay, let's have a quick look. Any reputation I didn't know about? Stoical. New. New instigator. Really? Oh, you know. There's a rabbi. Hello, rabbi. Uh, nine. Well, we can't really take any more prisoners at the moment, so let's just shut that off for now. We need to deal with what we've got. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything that I need to worry about. There's no unknowns here. Now, one thing I've got to do is look at prison policy because I haven't had it for very long. I found weapons. Um, so, destruction. Well, everything's going to be a search, isn't it? I mean, wh why would you not? 
which makes complete sense. Found luxuries. Um, punishment? No, not really. It's not great, it's not that big a deal. Weapons. Uh, weapons is serious doodah, so let's stick him for four. Tools, three. Drugs is less important. Intoxication, yeah. Serious injury, we go for five. Attack staff is also s quite serious. Nutritional policy, no variety. Low, just for now. Pro policy. 18. Yes, what did I set this to in the last gel? 15, I think. That'll do. No teacher. I'll stop that then. Yeah, because there's only one uh, one office at the time, isn't there? So we can't do more than one. Now, workshop safety induction. Should that not be running? What are we missing? Oh, there's a table. You idiot. Honestly. Is that all that was stopping that from running? Crazy fool. Now where you guys going? Working, 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 working. Okay. Well, on the plus side, I've had no violence, which is good. Looks like we're a bit thin on the ground staff-wise. One available. Mm. Okay, so you are escort prison. Alright, we need to hire another staff, I think. Maybe another couple. Make things a bit easier. Okay. Yeah, because we've been sort of deploying them and patrolling them and stuff like that, so. Oh, have they not got electricity yet? Fine. Notice that a lot. If, I've, if you try and put them somewhere like this, in a corner or in a wall, they just, it doesn't take and then the job just disappears, it fails and disappears I guess, but anyway, it's not the biggest deal in the world. Right, speed up. Well, prisoners are moaning. Sure they are. This reception area is fantastic. This was a really, really good addition to the game in the latest alpha. Having them searched on by default when they come in makes complete sense. Because you'd kind of forget and then you'd you know, have 20 prisoners coming which you forgot to search. <laughs> it's rubbish. So, form programs are working nicely. Three have passed spiritual guidance already. I don't know exactly what that is. Uh, led by spiritual leader. can see it pretty easy. So, do they get... They, they they obviously have a need here for um, spiritual spirituality. Sorry, do they get that even if they're not on a program? I wonder. I don't know. Of course, the other thing that the um, the airlock does for protective custody down here is it stops them getting ideas about going to work or going to the chapel or any of that sort of stuff. So they do have needs that would be unmet, like literacy and spirituality, but. It's only a minor thing, I think. Anyway, so we've got up to 37, uh, 59 prisoners. There's waiting to be processed, of course, so this is not actually a true reflection, but we're doing alright. However, hmm, two in shackle are in their cells or in solitary. Two are necessarily searched. Oh, we've got nobody in solitary. Must be these two here. Well, tough. Stoke instigator. But yeah. I am missing a trick. What I should be doing, I've just realised I should be stationing a guard here. So he doesn't leave. So he can process them and the guard has to come and fetch them. Otherwise this is left empty, that's a bit rubbish. So let's do that. That that works. So he's obviously not the guard that's been stationed. You've been stationed. But oh. Even though it's so stationed, he's actually wandering off him. Okay, fine. That didn't work quite as hard as I planned, but there we go. That's okay. Right. So yard time. The yard's working. Well, the three yards are working. They're all kind of all around. So yard then food's good because they're brought to the yard, which is 
all around the canteen when they go in and they eat. So that cuts down the amount of gap uh, between what they're doing before eating and actually eating. I'm, I've actually realised we've only got two cooks. Definitely need another couple of cooks because um, there's still empty plates and stuff in breakfast. We'd sort that out. So sink is there. We've got two fridges, one sink. I might put another sink. I don't think one sink is going to be enough for washing up and stuff, so let's do that. That's going to need to be plumped in, isn't it? Yay! Hey, dog's found its first contraband. Well done. Good work. Oh, look at that. There's a massive need for the toilets. Well... <laughs> Have you finished yet? No. Have you finished yet? No. Have you finished yet? No. How about now? No. Quite right, finished. No, I'm not interested. <laughs> How about you? Have you finished yet? Your minimum set. Go away or I'll kill you. <laughs> I think two toilets is enough. Do I need to stick another one? It's not like it's the end of the world, is it? It's all good. So family and recreation are quite high. Not enough recreation. They've got pool tables, they've got common rooms. They are able to get into the common rooms and, and everything, so... Yeah, that's all medium, that's, that's all zoned correctly. Maybe put some TVs outside or something. I'll tell you what I can do. Let's put some TVs in the... In here. For now. Not sure they need to be connect connected up specifically, but we'll see. So free time. So now you can go and do whatever you need to do, like recreation wise. So who's got recreation need? No, no, I can see. Oh, getting his family fix. Is he called Thor Hammer? <laughs> Great name. Right. Oh, teacher, let me go. Getting ready for his class. Right, well, this is all going fairly smoothly. Famous last words, I know, but. So, how many people have we got near them? We need the CCTV, I think one here, so it can, not, so it can kind of swing around. I think would be quite useful, actually. So we can see what's going on these two rooms. What else we need CCTV? Um, the classroom would be useful but a bit of a waste of one. I want to watch these cells if possible. I don't know how far they swing. Do they swing around kind of on 180 degrees? Let's, let's, let's watch this one. Let's speed this up. So it goes all the way no, it doesn't. It does that way, but not this way. What's, why, why doesn't it do that? It kind of jiggle, jiggle, and then it. Mm, fine. It doesn't make life easy, does it? Uh, let's put one in the middle here, and it can give us a span of. Actually, not max. We've got one there. See, this one is got a good arc on it, relatively. Um, so let's put one here, I think would be useful. CCTV. It starts off looking up, doesn't it? Yeah, there. So let's there, for instance. Okay. Now. That oh, does need power. It's right on one. So it's going to need power as well. Wow. Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't need power. Hmm, interesting. Okay. I didn't think they did. Where's the other CCTVs I've got? Yeah, they don't need power. I don't know why it was flashing like that, but okay, let's uh, let's cancel that. Uh, let's cancel. Hmm. 
Okay. Anyway, uh, desk connect. Connect up to that one. And connect up to that one. There we go. Sweet. Right. I think that is going to be the end of this particular episode. Make some good progress here. And we need to now basically expand the prison. Um, going to build more jail cells going up and obviously down there and also here as well. But what we need to work out is really who we're going to take on because the, uh, it's not many Max. Max are kind of building up again a lot more medium than Max. I really wasn't expecting that. But So let's expand medium out properly and then we'll expand Max as necessary. But we've got so much space in Max. We've got 17 capacity space so we'll, we'll, we'll take all of those and we'll expand medium for now. So that's that's what we'll do. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please leave a like or a comment, and I'll catch you on the next episode. Cheers, bye.